Well, Ryan, off we go again in this relentless schedule. Uh, it's a case of midweek at Blackpool, uh, Saturday, sorry, Sunday down in London at Arsenal. Then it's at Birmingham on a, a Wednesday. But at least you're back home this time. Yeah, exactly. Nice to be home. Um, there's a lot of games uh, coming up thick and fast now. But, uh, we've got a big squad, so I think we'll be ready for it. I think a word for the fans at this early stage of our, of our chat here, because for them, there's been over eight or 9,000 or so who have followed the team in the last three away games. I say two of them have been on a night, they have been decent journeys, but the fans have been terrific. Yeah, it's been a way for the whole season, you know, wherever we're going in the country, we know we're going to have good support and that really helps us, you know, especially going down to 10 men on the weekend, we've got the fans cheering us and that, it helps kick us on. Obviously the Birmingham game taking us to the top of the table, so that was very important game so but you know we've got a lot of professionals in the team so you know they made sure everyone's mind was on the Birmingham game sort of the minute after we finished the Arsenal game and I thought we took it into the game. For a while it looked as though it wasn't going to be the case one down at half time and a man down as well. Yeah no but you know we showed showed great character you know in the second half we we fought for Gibbo you know he, he thought he made a mistake so you know we fought to get him out of trouble and we, we did well in the second half played some good football even though yeah, we had a man list. That says everything about the team spirit, doesn't it? Exactly, yeah, a really good team spirit here. We all f- fight for everyone. If anyone makes mistakes, we all do our best to get them out of trouble and put no blame on anyone. At the end of the day, everyone makes mistakes and he's been classed for the last two months, probably been our best player, so you know, no blame can be put on him. You're up against a Leeds United side who are improving. They've won four of the, of the last five. They'll be bringing a few fans with them as well, so a, an atmosphere to save you would have thought. Yeah, we're we're aware of that. You know, we know they're in good form, and we know it's going to be a you know, highly contested game. But uh, we're ready for it. You know, we've got a big squad, a lot of players to come in. So yeah, we'll be ready.